Peggy 16. I play for the team Epsilon. We're currently a, a team competing on Call of Duty Ghosts and obviously with a view to qualifying for the Call of Duty World Championships. We've been playing together a total about two months now as a team. Not very long at all, but every team seems to have like a honeymoon period, what you'd call. Usually it only lasts for like two weeks, but I say ours has lasted for the whole time we've teamed, which is not really heard of. This is probably the most mature team I've been in. We're good at dealing with high pressure situations as well. We all have the experience and we all are really dedicated to winning. From the top eight teams, there's not really much of a skill gap in between players. So then it just comes down to how you play within a team and how you work. Tommy, he would be the slayer, picking up kills, making the objective easier for us. He's a bit of a joker, he's always chatting, he never, he never shuts up really. Me and Tommy like to have a bit of banter with Flux now and then. We have kind of the same personality in a lot of aspects. Myself and Flux, we are the aggressive SMGs of the team. If you uh, talk to a lot of teams around, they'd um, describe me as the most annoying player to play against. You just know that he's going to be getting in the other team's face and stopping their game being able to play. Jerd, he's quite quiet, but his desire to win is almost unparalleled. He's known for being extremely composed in game, even when the other three, including myself, are all kicking off, screaming and shouting, he'll be there just sat with the same blank expression on his face. Swanee, he's more of a defensive player, so he'll prefer to post up in certain areas of the maps. He's quite notorious as well, he's quite um, mellow, but at times if you're losing or if he's, he's annoyed, like you will know about it because he's got a fiery temper. If Ryan's moaning, then Swanee, that gets Swanee started and it's just is a whole cycle, but we get along very well. No one has any hates towards anyone else or dislikes in their personalities, I'd say. Not that I know of anyway, unless they hate me. <laughs> Our biggest challenge will probably be TCM Gaming, which is actually my uh, former teammates. Jordan and Swanee, who were in Epsilon, they had a previous teammate called Madcat. He then left to join TCM, and that meant that Blocks got dropped from TCM. So if we do end up meeting, there's a hell of a lot of history behind it, and uh, it could be an incredible watch. The next step really is, of course, we're reaching the World Championships. We definitely have the confidence that we're going to make it. If we can win this and prove that we actually are one of the best teams in Europe, then I feel we can definitely do a few upsets in the World Finals. <laughs>